Hi, I'm Jo Greenfield. I'm European Head of Sales for FCM. Hi, I'm Fiona Lee. I work for Marriott International as a Global TMC Account Director and I look after Flight Centre. So in the world world of 2020-21 in our industry, can you give us a bit of a view on the position of Marriott now? Yeah, sure. So building on 90 years of legacy, our hotel chain is the world's largest. Um, we are deployed in 133 countries. We have 31 brands. Uh, we have 7,600 plus hotels and we also have 147 million Marriott Bonvoy members. Amazing. So you mentioned Bonvoy, which is obviously a huge loyalty programme. How has that changed for, your, for the travellers who are travelling nowadays? So many of our frequent travellers would have seen and experienced the Marriott app. Marriott Bonvoy app. Um, those that are using it would notice that we've made changes to the app um, during uh, the COVID pandemic, which is to include the mobile check-in um, facility as well. Uh, many of our hotels have the contactless digital key. Um, we also have the uh, in-dining room in, uh, requests as well. So if you want to order room service instead of going down to the restaurant, you are able to do that as well. And we also have the mobile chat so you can engage with anyone on property. And that can be done prior to check in or uh, during the stay. So those are the things that we've got in place on the Marriott Bonvoy app, which limits the uh, number of contact with right. other people. So it's a great experience for yeah. the travellers. Um, well, that's good to know. So we've worked together for a long time. Um, obviously, the requirements of, of TMCs working with suppliers have become more and more important um, in the last year or so. So can you tell us a bit about the partnership that we have? Yeah, as, as a global preferred partner, you know that I'm one of many of uh, the global associates that are from their global sales organisation. And together, mutually, we're just man managing the day-to-day -day requests and, and the, um, or the management of the account and making sure that our travellers have seamless experiences, but also your corporate buyers also have a great experience with us as well in terms of um, having access to all the facilities that we have available. Great. Um, and one of the big things that's been important is safety um, and people feeling confident to travel. What's Marriott doing with, with safety protocols? So you would have seen many cleaning programmes that have been um, talked about across the year. Uh, Marriott's uh, been very uh, vocal in sharing information around our commitment to clean. Our commitment to clean has been set up and, and we're, we're advised by our cleanliness council. Um, various organisations within the industry have been able to kind of give us guidelines on the various protocols and the cleaning um, habits that we've now ad adopted in our, our hotels. So our commitment to clean is just one of the big um, things that we have going on in the back um, as well as our connect with confidence allowing for uh, attendees to attend meetings and feeling confident to return to travel. Great so you mentioned meetings and events as things start to open up that's one of the things that's now um, going to be more important so what's Marriott doing to make people feel confident to have meetings and events? So all of our uh, event planners and our staff on property are putting the customers at ease. First and foremost, we have um, social distancing measures in place. Um, we're, followed, uh, we're following guidelines on a day-to-day -day basis as and where they change. We also offer hybrid meetings as well. So we do have uh, technology providers that allow us to provide those hybrid meetings. So you can have your maximum in the meeting room, but also dial in many people from different locations around the globe. Um, we also have different options available in food and beverage as well, where you can have grab and go or or you can choose from a select buffet all wrapped um, and also we use our uh, flexible terms as well to just really put the customers at ease making sure that you know if there's anything that wish to change in our lockdown measures and, and the restrictions that we are able to to change with great with so family. people can feel confident to book right. and know that, that they can change things as necessary yeah. which is great i suppose the other thing that's come up a lot in our industry is sustainability which used to be a bit of a buzzword but is now really important, really important. so what's marriott's view on sustainability so since our founding in 1927 our company owners mr bill marriott and family have really wanted to make sure that we are taking care of our environment our community and our associates one of the big things that marriott has put out there is that we've trained 750,000 associates across the globe and we tend to do that every three months on human trafficking so just being able to spot the signs of how to uh, find out if there's any human trafficking around you this amongst 
working with suppliers as well, making sure that we're working with um, diverse and, and um, equal, equal rights suppliers and ensuring that that's all the way throughout the hotels. That on top of recycling and various other yeah. initiatives. So one of the biggest things that we've talked about recently with one of our brands, Addition, was to remove all single use plastics. So that's quite a big statement from us. Yeah, absolutely. Now that's great news as well. I suppose to end, can you tell us something that nobody knows about Marriott? Hmm. Uh, so, I don't know if anyone would know this, but Mary actually opens a hotel every 14 hours. 14 hours, right. Impressive. We're in a new hotel tomorrow. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Thanks so much, Fiona, for your time. It's no great welcome. to hear. Thank you.